Hello, I'm Saran Norris and we're back with another demo here. We are in San Francisco and one of the most prominent houses in San Francisco are Victorian houses. Of course, those are the houses that I used in the show Bob's Burger. So what I want to do today is I want to teach you how to draw a Victorian house. Let's go. Okay, I've got my marker here. Let's get drawing. Now the first thing that I wanna do is draw the bay windows. Now I think that is the most characteristic part of a Victorian house. Now these bay windows are basically gonna be the front of the house, okay? These are going to be uh, a total of six windows, okay? Let's start drawing here. I wanna cut that in from the main bay window and then I want to do a nice angle here, a nice angle here. This is going to be kind of the top. Now, these are all the lines that we want to play off from here on out. I'm going to take this straight down. Okay, now every line that we want to make has to kind of have a little bit of perspective. Victorian houses have a lot of detail in them. And the fun part is, is that you can kind of make up a lot of this detail yourself. Nothing has to be exact. Just depends on how much art and detail you want to put in each one of these. Okay, now let's put in the windows. A lot of our Victorian houses in San Francisco have rounded windows at the top. So let's take advantage and use those. The reason why we draw Victorians is because we're trying to draw houses that are unique and also kind of look a little bit alive. So really try to use all its characteristics to the best of your ability. Now, this is a really great house, but nobody can get inside it. Let's draw the entrance. Gotta get inside. Let's draw the door. Usually there's a room above the door and a little bit of architecture that sticks out, little deck or patio. Okay, there it is. If you wanna add a little bit more, add a little street. Maybe a street light. And maybe a little tree. Okay, 